Good morning. Today is Tuesday, March 24th. Today is the fourth Thursday of the month. How many more days do we have in the month of March? Count them with me. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There are seven more days in the month of March. Today is the 24th. Let's look at the number 24. Is 24 an even number or an odd number? It's an even number. All numbers that end in 0, 2, 4, 6, or 8 are even numbers. Let's sing that together. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, and 24. Do you want to sing some more? Yes! The back of our card shows two groups of 10 and four ones. 10, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. We're going to look at our 100s chart. Did you notice that there are four number tags missing? We're going to figure out what they are. Let's take a look. This is the number 35. Hmm. What number would come before 35? What is one less than 35? Did you say 34? You'd be right. All right. What number would be 10 less than 35? It would go way up here. What is 35 take away 10? Did you say 25? You'd be right. All right, what about 10 more than 35? Did you say 45? 45 is 10 more than 35. And then we only have one space left. It is one more than 35. It's 36. Good job. We're gonna be going over our clock. Let's take a look at it together. What time is it? It's 12 o'clock. What time is it? It's 12.30. What time is it? It's 1 o'clock. What time is it? It's 1.30. What time is it? It's 2 o'clock. What time is it? It's 2.30. What time is it? It's 3 o'clock. What time is it? It's 3.30. What time is it? It's 4 o'clock. What time is it? It's five o'clock. What time is it? It's 5.30. What time is it? It's six o'clock. What time is it? It's 6.30. Do you remember how many minutes there are in an hour? How long does it take for the minute hand to go all the way around the clock? Did you say 60? There's 60 minutes every hour. Let's skip count by the number five. Learning to skip count by five is very important because we need it when we're telling time and when we're counting money. Let's begin. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60. Let's count by 10. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 110, 120. You should come up with a song for this one for me because I don't have one. Today we're going to practice counting money. I'm going to use nickels and pennies. And we're going to be practicing transitioning between counting by five and counting by one. Let's begin. Five, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 
40, 41, 42. Was it tricky for you when we switched from nickels to pennies? Let's try another one. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39. Remember, when we're counting nickels, we count by five. When we count pennies, we count by one. I would like for you to practice counting money today. I would like for you to get a little pile of money with pennies and nickels and dimes in it. And I would like for you to practice. First step was we always separate the nickels and the pennies and the dimes from each other. And we start with our biggest coin. So if you have dimes in your pile, you'll start counting your dimes. And you count those by 10. And when you get to the nickels, you'll start counting by five. And then your pennies, you'll count by one. Maybe you could play store.